Now, Sportsline. Utah State is looking for a new head football coach after Gary Anderson was let go on Saturday. The 0-3 Aggies have lost by an average of 28 points per game. Today, Athletic Director John Hartwell explained the decision. That's not the product uh, he wanted. That's not what I want. That's not what any of Aggie Nation want, wanted. And it was not just a matter of where we were. It was the trajectory of the program. Here's what I want. I, I don't want to establish any preconceived parameters. I want us to find the best guy for this job. Do they have to have coached here, uh, lived here, have a certain number of, of people on the staff uh, that have been here? No, I'm, I'm not going to, to box us into that. I want us to be wide open in this search and, uh, you know, go find the best person, the best candidate to lead Utah State football forward. Co-defensive coordinator Frank Miley will serve as the interim coach for the remainder of the season. He spoke about the task that lies before him. These next five weeks we owe to these kids. Uh, everything that we know, everything that we are, uh, mind, body, and soul, we have to give to these kids. That's what we owe to them. That's why we're in this business. Uh, and so nothing's changed from that perspective. It's always been about the kids. That's one thing I've learned from Gary is, uh, you know, everything's about the kids. Without the kids, we're not sitting here in this in this seat. And so uh, that, that's the biggest thing for us right now. That's the only thing that really matters is uh, making this experience a, a good one to finish out these next five games. So we'll see where they go from here, Todd. Yeah, that's uh, he's filled that interim role before. Yeah, when Matt Wells left uh, to take the Texas Tech uh, Texas Tech job, uh, he filled in for the Utah State's bowl game to, to serve as interim head coach for that one game. But uh, he's going to have more games to deal with this time yeah, around for sure. Quite a so. few more. But yeah. their focus on the on the student athletes that's that's where it is. Yeah, and we'll see uh, where where they go for their new head coach. Sounds like they're open to anybody who they feel is a fit, regardless of. You know what their r relationship with Utah State is. Yeah. So. Okay. All right, Dylan. Thanks.